we have to talk about detoxing radiation from your body. I'm not talking about 4G, 5G, microwave radiation. I'm talking about uranium, thorium, radium, that kind of stuff. Radiation is one of the top 10 major causes of chronic illness. So here they are. There's three toxins, chemicals, metals, radiation. And then there's five organisms, Lyme, parasites, bacteria, virus, and fungus slash mold. And then we have two more left. One is that your organs of drainage, such as liver, gallbladder, lymphatic system, and colon aren't working very well. Get those going with herbs and supplements. And the last one is excess sugar metabolism. Eating too much sugar, grains, you got to bring that sugar content in your blood down. There's the top 10 causes of chronic illness. And radiation is one of them. And who talks about it? Half of Americans are drinking radium in their water. And it's 3,000 times stronger than uranium. And there's a website that shows this. It's the Environmental Working Group. And you can click on these dots. These are reports from water municipalities. And the, the ones that are lighter color, they show radium below 1.0 but there shouldn't be any radium in the water. The ones that are orange are between one and five and the ones that are red are above five. The federal government says that the radium content above five is dangerous, but the radium content, in my opinion, above zero is dangerous. You want it to be zero. 80% of Texas has radium in their water. Radioactive elements are like hot coals in your body emitting from the inside out, destroying the DNA and the immune system and the tissues constantly. It's important to get this out and I'm going to go over how. Fukushima, Chernobyl, and Three Mile Island are still factors in our lives and on this planet. There are 52 nuclear power plants operating without a license. You can google Radium Belt Wisconsin to see why Lyme disease is so prevalent in that part of the country. Radium in the soil naturally occurring is causing disease on the humans that are walking around in southeastern Wisconsin. And that why, that's why there's so much Lyme disease in that area. There's a product from Cellcore Biosciences called CT Minerals, it's a liquid in a bottle this size. And in, when Fukushima blew up, the government officials of Japan had a contest to find out what product would reduce the radiation out of the soil, the cows, the people, the water. And CT Minerals won that competition. They had vats of water and they put radiation in their radio, radioactive elements and the various scientists from all over the world brought their therapies and they applied their therapies to the water. The water that had the CT minerals added had so little radiation in it that the government officials said, oh, we made a mistake. We didn't put enough radioactive elements in that vat of water, we have to do it again. And these guys who created CT minerals said, no, you did it right. Our product just works that good. So they did it again, and then they did it again. Sure enough, CT Minerals won that competition. Now, the people at Cellcore Biosciences that make CT Minerals since have made other products that are even more powerful for detoxing radiation. Here are symptoms of radioactive elements in your body. Now, of those 10 causes of chronic illness I listed, any of those can cause any of these symptoms. But radiation has a certain constellation of symptoms. Let's go over this really quickly right now. Fatigue, anemia, skin issues like dry skin or rashes, hair loss, dry eyes, seizures, history of cancer, chronic candida infections, hormone or fertility problems, suppressed immune system like you can't clear infections despite following correct pathogen protocols, osteoporosis or osteopenia, kidney or urinary problems like bladder infections, burning, pain with urination, and then digestive symptoms, taste changes, dry mouth, difficulty swallowing, and stomach ulcers. The solution involves CT minerals, this liquid, and it's in step six of the seven-step blueprint to optimal health. You have to do the other steps first because then you get complete healing at the end of the seven steps. So the first step is diet. Second is increasing mitochondrial function for maximum ATP production, that's energy production. Third is drainage. Make sure your lymphatic system, liver, gallbladder, colon, lung, skin, and sinuses, all these organs of drainage work well. Number four, in 
uh, clean out the intestines of parasites, mucoid, plaques, ropeworms, step five, full body cleansing. There's fantastic supplements that make you blow parasites out of your nose. Then step six, powerful detoxification. And if you need step seven, that's getting organisms out of your, inside of your cells. I've had people go to other doctors, they do a detox program, and one woman lost 90% of her hair. Another woman that I saw many years ago, her kidneys got so clogged up that her legs filled up with urine and she couldn't pee. I had to fix that. She was seeing a really good holistic doctor, but he didn't know these steps. If he knew step three, drainage, he would have been able to prevent her kidney dysfunction. But I had to salvage her and I had to fix her kidneys because he jumped right into step six without doing the first five steps in the beginning. Now you can take this radiation toxicity quiz. I'll put the link in the first comment below. I also put it in the description box below this video. And you can see if you have a collection of symptoms that might indicate radiation. Right now, as far as blood tests or urine tests, there are urine tests that you can take to see if you have uranium, for example, in your body. But as far as testing radium, there's only one urine test for that and it's not available to civilians. It's only available in the military. Now, when you're detoxing using the right products, you detox everything out. You don't have to match up one product for one toxin and then find the next toxin and find the next product. You just have maybe two or three really good detox products and they pull everything out, including plastics, the chemicals, the metals, and the radiation. And that's what I specialize in is reversing your chronic health problem. It's not an over, overnight process. It can take many months or even years to get your health back from chronic illness. If you have a broken bone or an acute infection, go see a medical doctor. But if you have a chronic problem that's a, over a year old, over four years old, over 20 years old, you need a different type of science to get your health back. You need to improve your health rather than supplying antidotes, antidepressants, antibiotics, antivirals, anti-anxiolytics. In medicine, they're squashing symptoms. It's okay for the short term, but in the meantime, you have to save your life at home between medical doctor visits. And that's where I come in and my team and all the fantastic army of holistic healthcare providers, natural acupuncturists, chiropractors, nutritionists, dietitians that look at the physiology of the body. They understand how the body is supposed to work and they can put those pieces back together and make your body function better. And when you function better, your symptoms are gone, your disease is gone. And that's healthcare the way mother nature designed it to be. So take that quiz.